Hey there, YouTubers. Thank you for viewing. Hey, good to YouTube. It's Beer Bong 420. Malt liquor, beer beverage, beer cooler review. I almost said beverage there. Um, we're looking at a local for local. Now, this for local, I have actually had it a number of years ago, and it had the Spanish name for the flavor on it, Uba. It was 12%, and because of how many years back it was, being a while, I'm pretty sure the so-called college kids that like misused these products and had the recipe get changed and them taken off the market thing for a while, I don't think it happened yet, so it probably was still the energy drink version OG style. It was 12%, it was Uva, last time I had it, a long time ago. Now I can get them here, but as the English name, great flavor. So let's look at the great flavor, folks. Barley malt, high fructose corn syrup, natural and artificial flavors, citric acid, sodium acetate, sodium bentoate, color. It's 8%. <coughs> Contains barley malt, local grape flavor, severe de raison for loco, um, barley malt liquor with natural and artificial flavors, produced by the Drink Fork Brewing Company in La Crosse, Wisconsin, and under special agreement, Latrobe, Pennsylvania, United States of America. Black tab. I'm just watching all that thing everyone calls smoke coming out. Yeah, you might smell a tiny little bit of it from a distance. Huh, it's like the same as the cake glass size. Huh. <coughs> One shot, two shot. Be shot four, take that bottle to the head, and one and more. Drink, 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 drink. Okay, I just poured it, and I got a lot of head off it, but the head just kept going down, 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 down. So now there's less in the glass. It's just dark in that purple color. Although the screen might show it black, but. Maybe it shows it the purple way, but it's very dark with some purple, like a very dark purple. And it just smells like grape. Yeah, grape. Grape for local, 8%. Some places will see it as uva, and uva is still the grape. That version is 12%. And when I had it at 12% uva, I probably saw it the energy drink side. That was lots of years ago. This is great. 8% for local cheers. Straight up, it's just a cold grape drink. And it's the ending of this sip. That's a tiny little rough. Then it goes into a tiny little bit of a sourness, and then it turns into a little bit of a warmth in the stomach. Otherwise, it just tastes like a straight up cold grape beverage and nothing else. So it's not probably going to be a long video here. Hmm. Crap, I forgot something. I'll be right back. I don't know if I'm gonna do I don't know if I'm gonna do this up in a video or not. But with the drink, I'm gonna enjoy a juicy J here because I'm you get two of them in a pack. And then whatever flavor you pick up from the ones available, and they come with that little filter you can take on or off. But look, to go with my grape for local, I'm gonna have a grape. See grape? It's all it's grape flavored. And it's uh, the 
Grape Jones from those Juicy J's. They'll complement it. So, um, I gotta say, um, I'm not gonna say every single Fort Local flavor I've ever had because maybe I'll forget. And that doesn't mean every flavor I've had with caffeine, and that doesn't mean every flavor I've had 8 and 12%. Some have just been like the one, right? But I gotta say, back in the day, I didn't like blue raspberry. For some reason, I called it wasp poison. I remember calling it that. It was 12% and more likely caffeinated back in the day. And, um, the last. And then there was another flavor I had before where just parts of it were grow not 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 the best so I mean most flavors usually are not bad I guess so until you swallow this drink you're just getting a wet grape taste which you could easily mistake it for grape soda grape energy drink something like that you definitely can't mistake it for a grape energy shot you would find it disgusting or something at that point because how some energy shots are but then once you swallow the sip you get a little bit of a roughness maybe a little bit of a sourness on some sips and then your belly just feels a tiny little bit of a warmth or at least that's how it's treating me so not the most amazing grape taste I'm getting right now but yeah, it's a decent one. There's obviously better flavors and small amount that are worse. Um, 775. 8% grape. For local. Cheers. For local juicy J thing. Mm. I'm not loving this drink, but I'm liking it. <laughs> And I don't know if it's the dead on exact same way the twelve percent Uva grape was because not so long ago. But maybe it's the exact dead on taste or maybe 